Hi, I'm Tash from Heart and Design. Thanks for coming along and learning how to draw with me. I really appreciate it. And if you're watching this video, it's because you've purchased through for my sheets, for the download, for this video, and for the other videos on how to colour and paint it. Uh, I hope your journey in art is fun and therapeutic for you. Remember, there's no right or wrong in art. I'm just giving you the tools to get you started. And um, yeah, where you go with it is up to you. This is our how to draw a pineapple sheet, part of the summer pack. You will need a pencil, it uh, doesn't matter what, but I have an HB. You will need an eraser, uh, this is a rubber one and this is a kneadable eraser which you can squidge and change shapes. It's quite good for getting into, you can make little points and get into crevices and things. So, let's get started on the actual sheet. now. Um, this is difficulty level one, so this really is for beginners. Now remember, beginners can be anyone from a very young infant all the way up to very old. So um, please don't, don't take this as being just for children. It's for everybody who is just starting out, okay? It doesn't matter what your age is. So we're going to follow the instructions of the sheet. So first of all, we trace one, two and three. So the first one, as you can see, is really simple. It's just an oval shape, but it's kind of um, not totally straight, but not totally rounded at the ends. Is the only way I can describe that. Now, everything we do in art is comes from lines and shapes. So once you realise that, then it starts to open up the world of art to you. So that shape, I'm just going to draw again for you up here, small. You won't need to do this, but this is just so that you can see. So it's an oval shape but with slightly flatter ends okay don't worry about it too much just something roughly like that then once we've traced that we can trace the top of the pineapple now I'm using my pencil quite high up now that means I'm doing it so that you can see what I'm doing whereas normally if I'm doing something like that I would hold my pencil quite close and go over it that way but it's not as easy for you to see but I would recommend quite close to the front whenever you're doing detail hold the pencil there whenever you're doing bigger shapes move the pencil so it's about halfway and when you're really loosely just shading you can hold the pencil at the very end that simple tool will help you okay so we're going to the top of the pineapple just to show you on here it's a curved shape with another curved shape on top basically curve curve go the other way curve 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 and then the lines in the middle to match and that's it that's all the top of the pineapple is so <clears throat> we've done all of that we've we've traced that we're going to trace our final one and that's just our zigzag lines okay just little triangles up and down 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 so again over here so you can see it's just triangles up down up down okay and when you do on the pineapple like that now you can do it as i've done it is very flat or you can do it as kind of just coming round a bit as well because no pineapple is perfect perfect lines but i just this is line art so it's very simpli simplified just to get you started so we're going to go in and do that pineapple shape okay there we go see how i did that quite quickly I'm not worrying too much it's a pineapple nothing's perfectly shaped in life so now i'm going to go in and do some quite big stalks now if you're pressing nice and lightly you can go in afterwards and make changes really easily by rubbing out i'm trying to press quite hard for you so that you can actually see what i'm doing on the sheet i hope that makes sense anyway um so then we come to the zigzags let's go slow there's no rush you know sometimes i feel that I want to, when I want to get into the flow of doing things like that top of the pine, I want to go quick, I want to do quick movements. But when I'm doing a bit more detail, now I'm going to try and hold my pencil at the base there. There we go. They don't need to be perfect, okay? They don't need to finish at the perfect angle. It's all good, okay? This is just you having fun and seeing where it ends up. Look, I meant because I've done it bigger, I could actually do another one in there as well. Let's go for it. Let's do another one. Okay, so that's it. We're done. That's your pineapple drawing. Now you could keep practicing if you didn't feel quite happy with that one. If you want to try and perfect it, just keep going until you are ready and it's perfect. And then the next four videos, we do move on to how to colour it, how to paint it, 
um, we go with uh, coloured pencils, acrylic paint, watercolours and pastels. So I hope to see you there. Thanks so much for joining me. Don't forget to visit the website um, heartanddesign.org.uk and linked in the video were all my social media um, pages for Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, things like that. Please do follow and I'll see you in the next video.